Chapter 6 Loops in Python Learning Objectives Understand loops Use while loops Apply jump statements Use for loops Explore the range function in Python programming, loops are essential structures that allow repetitive execution of a block of code. Loops are particularly useful when a task needs to be repeated multiple times with minimal code. Python offers two primary loop structures for loops and while loops, each type of loop serves different purposes and is suitable for various situations. For loop, the for loop in Python is used to iterate over a sequence like a list, tuple, dictionary or string and perform a set of operations on each element. The general syntax of a for loop is example. In this example, the loop iterates over each item in the fruits list and prints it. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 1. To calculate the sum of all the numbers in a list. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Explanation of the code. The variable numbers is assigned a list containing the integers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. The variable total is initialized to 0. The for loop is used to iterate through each element in the numbers list. The loop takes each number from the list one by one and adds it to the total variable. The plus equal sign operator is shorthand for total equal sign total plus number, which means add the value of number to total. Iteration breakdown. First iteration number is 1. So total becomes 0 plus 1 equals 1. Second iteration number is 2. So total becomes 1 plus 2 equals 3. Third iteration number is 3. So total becomes 3 plus 3 equals 6. Fourth iteration number is 4. So total becomes 6 plus 4 equals 10. Fifth iteration number is 5. So total becomes 10 plus 5 equals 15. The print function is then used to display the result. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 2. To print each character of a string, Python on a new line. Explanation of the code. The variable text is assigned the string Python. The for loop is used to go through each character in the string text. The loop assigns each character in the string to the variable char one by one. Iteration Breakdown First iteration char is p and it is printed. Second iteration char is y and it is printed. Third iteration char is t and it is printed. Fourth iteration char is H and it is printed. Fifth iteration char is O and it is printed. Sixth iteration char is N and it is printed. The print function outputs each character on a new line as the loop iterates through the string. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 3. To calculate the squares of all the numbers stored in a list 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 4. To find the sum of all even numbers in a list 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. The range function in Python. The range function in Python is used to generate a sequence of numbers.
This function is commonly used in loops to iterate over a sequence of numbers in a simple and efficient way. Syntax of range function The range function can be used in several ways. 1. Range stop generates numbers from 0 to stop minus 1. Example, range 5 generates 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. 2. Range, start, stop, generates numbers from start to stop, minus, 1. Example, range 2, 7 generates, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 3. Range start, stop, step, generates numbers from start to stop, minus, 1. Incremented by step. Example, Range 1, 10, 2, generates 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. Program 5, to generate a sequence of numbers from 0 to 4 using the range function, with a single argument. Explanation of the code. The sequence produced by range 5 is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. In each iteration of the loop, the variable i takes on the next value in the sequence. So, in the first iteration, i is 0, in the second iteration, i is 1, and so on, until i becomes 4 in the fifth iteration. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 6 to generate numbers from 3 to 7 using the range function with two arguments. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 7. To generate numbers from 2 to 10 with a step of 2 using the range function with three arguments. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 8. To take a user's name as input and print it five times using a for loop with the range function. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 9. To print the multiplication table of an input number. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. No more. Replace the asterisk with any other symbol or character to create a different pattern. While loop. The while loop in Python continues to execute a block of code as long as a specified condition remains true. The syntax of a while loop is Example, printing numbers from 1 to 5. In this example, the loop will print the numbers from 1 to 5. The variable i is incremented by 1 in each iteration and the loop continues until i is greater than 5. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Program 10. Find the sum of the first 10 natural numbers. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Infinite loop An infinite loop is a loop that runs endlessly because the condition that controls the loop never becomes false. Infinite loops can occur in both for and while loops. Infinite loops can be intentional, for example, in programs that are designed to run continuously or unintentional often due to a mistake in the loop's condition or logic. Example, an infinite loop using the while loop. Explanation The condition in the while loop is true, which is always true, so the loop will run indefinitely. The string, this is an infinite loop, will be printed continuously without stopping. Did you know? Infinite loops might be used in applications like servers, real-time monitoring systems or games, where the program needs to keep running until it is manually stopped. Fact
An infinite loop can be stopped by pressing Ctrl plus C in the terminal or by manually closing the program window. Example. An unintentional infinite loop caused by a mistake in the loop condition. Explanation. The loop condition IE0 will always be true because I is incremented by 1 in each iteration. As a result, I keeps increasing and the loop never terminates. Tidbit. To avoid unintentional infinite loops, always ensure that the loop's condition will eventually be met and that any variables controlling the loop are updated correctly within the loop. Jump statements in Python. Jump statements in Python allow you to control the flow of loops. The most commonly used jump statements are break and continue. Each of these statements serves a different purpose in managing the flow of the loop. Break statement The break statement is used to exit a loop prematurely. When a break statement is encountered inside a loop, the loop is immediately terminated and the control moves to the next statement after the loop. Program 11 Exiting a loop when a condition is met using a break statement. Explanation The loop runs from 1 to 10, but when I becomes 5, the break statement is executed, causing the loop to terminate. Only the numbers 1 to 4 are printed. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Continue statement the continue statement skips the current iteration of the loop and moves to the next iteration. When a continue statement is encountered, the remaining code inside the loop is skipped for that iteration. Program 12. Skipping an iteration using a continue statement. Explanation. The loop runs from 1 to 5, but when I becomes 3, the continue statement is executed, causing the loop to skip printing 3. All alls along alls are printed, except 3. After running the program specified above, the output displayed is as follows. Chapter Essentials Python loops, including for and while loops, allow repetitive code execution for tasks needing repetition. For loops, iterate over sequences like lists or strings performing operations on each element. The range function generates numeric sequences commonly used in loops for iteration with start, stop and step options. While loops continue executing code blocks as long as the specified condition remains true. Infinite loops occur when loop conditions never become false, either intentionally or due to logical errors. Python's break and continue statements control loop flow, allowing early exits or skipping iterations. The break statement exits loops when specific conditions are met, shifting control to the next statement. The continue statement skips the current loop iteration, moving directly to the next one.